Good morning. Occasionally I get a little stumped in thinking of a thinking of you message. I just can't come up with a message easily. No amount of head scratching or gazing out the window will help, at least not at first. Do you ever get stumped or feel that you have nothing to say? Maybe nothing to write if you're working on a paper or a project or a message? What can sometimes help, me at least, is taking a walk for inspiration. Maybe it's the exercise that gets the ideas flowing. It might be helpful to talk with a family member or a friend to get an idea. It is fun to bounce ideas off someone else. I also like to read the Bible, of course, and get inspired with a Bible verse to share. There's no shortage of those. Here's a good Bible verse to share. Oh, give thanks to the Lord. Call upon his name. Make known his deeds among the peoples. 1 Chronicles 16.8 Aha! An idea for thinking of you. This verse reminds us of all the amazing deeds that God is doing in our church of late. For example, the Zebulon United Methodist Church Preschool is reopening on January the 3rd. After much prayer and visioning and planning by the preschool advisory board. We're having another annual Thanksgiving Day lunch on Thanksgiving Day, of course. It starts at 11 o'clock and it's free for the community. We held warming of the hearts last Saturday and the outreach event went very well. We also look forward to Youth Sunday this Sunday, November 20th, as well as Advent starting soon and then Christmas Eve and Christmas. There is a great reason. All these are great reasons to be thankful. And it's a wonderful season to give thanks. Thanks to the Lord, I'm no longer stumped. God's deeds are always worth thinking about and talking about. Don't you agree? Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for all the ways that you are blessing Zebulon United Methodist Church. Everyone who spreads the word, who meets to make plans, who works to reach the goals, and who spends time for your glory, we thank you. May we come together even more in the days and weeks ahead to accomplish your purposes for us. And for anyone who might be stumped or lack inspiration for our project, or assignment. Please help those in need today. Amen. Have a wonderful day.